to enable our local farmers to play an active role in transforming our farming sector, we formed an Industry Consultation Panel, or ICP, early this year. It consists of progressive farmers representing various food farm types, as well as academics who can help translate research in agricultural technology into practical implementation in our farms. Together, practitioners, researchers, academics, policymakers will work together to innovate, co-create, and transform our farming sector through technology. Through various focus group discussions involving the ICP, as well as meeting up with farmers directly, we develop a farm transformation map, or FTM, to guide the transformation of our farming sector in four areas physical space, innovation, people development, and the larger broad ecosystem. Firstly, to overcome space constraints, we need to go upwards into the sky, downwards into the ocean, and even inwards into our buildings. Second, we need more innovation. To optimize limited space and increase production use, we need to push technological boundaries. We need to pursue water and energy efficiency. We need to automate. We need to integrate. Integrate the systems through robotics and sensors. We need the right people to achieve our vision. Transforming the sector requires a knowledge-based workforce. Our modern farmers should be more appropriately called agri-technologists or agri-specialists, not just farmers. We will need a generation of agri-specialists with multidisciplinary expertise. Farming will no longer just be about horticulture, no longer just be about aquaculture. It will no longer just be about toiling in the sun, doing manual labor, but about engineering, about infocom technology, about entrepreneurship and R&D. Fourthly, we need to grow the ecosystem. It is about creating an active ecosystem an environment where our farms can thrive. And in this regard, the ICP, the Industry Consultation Panel, pointed out that tight cash flows often limit the farmers from investing in more expensive technology. The current Agricul Agriculture Productivity Fund, or APF, co-funds investments in technology, but only on a reimbursement basis after the farmers have spent the money, their own money. We have listened to the suggestions put forth by the ICP Therefore, from April this year, the APF will disburse up to 30% of the approved funding quantum upfront to facilitate the adoption of technology. So this will complement our move to increase the tenure of farmlands to 20-year leases from the current 10 plus 10, based on industry feedback. AVA will also adopt a new account management approach to our farms. What this means is that each farm will now have a dedicated account manager to advise them on business development, technology adoption, and financial assistance. The account manager will facilitate the farmers' interactions with many agencies, and they will also work with stakeholders. Think of them, think of these account managers as the equivalent of Spring Singapore for our farming industry. This farm transformation map is just in its infancy. We will continue to work with ICP and other stakeholders to refine it as we gain momentum and as technology for farming matures. Mm -hmm.